Hello, my name is Jay Didi, CEO of AwarePoint Corporation. AwarePoint is pleased to support the ACCE Elders documentary outlining the history of innovation and excellence in the profession of clinical engineering. Hi, my name is Mario Castaneda. I am the president of the American College of Clinical Engineering. I am now in my second term. I've been there for two years in this position, although I have been a member of ACC since uh, 2003 officially. The American College of Clinical Engineering is a, an organization that is at the center of patient care delivery with technology. Our ultimate goal is to use technology to enhance the healthcare of the communities. This country is one of the few countries that is struggling to really having an ideal level of care. We're at 17th in the world in terms of morbidity and mortality. We can do better than that. This is about enhancing the health of communities. This is about technology bringing really the promise of delivering effective and lower cost health care. It's a very rewarding uh, life role to play in the healthcare industry and what you can do in improving technology and through improving technology, improving the, the skills and abilities to promote healthcare. The American College of Clinical Engineering is about leadership. Our organization helped them be better leaders uh, and also give them the, the skill sets and the tools to be efficient and uh, contributors not only to the organization, the workforce, so to healthcare delivery in general. ACC is also about stewardship, a stewardship of patient safety. Now in this new technology, we have many technologies coming together. We need to ensure that the patient is safe. We also want to provide the appropriate tools for the physicians and caregiver to give the appropriate care. Another part of a strategic direction for American College of Clinical Engineering is collaboration and partnership. Now we have a great challenge with the technologies converging. We need to work with other organizations to be able to resolve the complex issues that are resulting from mixing all these technologies. Organizations such as AMI, HIMSS, ECRI Institute, the FDA, the Joint Commission, come together and we form national summits as a model to look at the current issues, to look for the priorities, and really to prevent the problems of the future. One of the benefits of being part of the American College of Clinical Engineering is when you join, you will become are part of a group of leaders, leaders in the field, not only on the big projects they are running, but also they run many departments uh, of the major organizations in the United States and around the world. Another great benefit of becoming part of the American College of Clinical Engineering is that you will be at the crux, at the center of the information that is current and um, that is relevant in the field. We have uh, several activities uh, like symposiums that bring the brightest and the best together to provide information um, that is very much uh, in accordance to what is going on right now. But above all, you have the opportunity to talk to your peers, to your fellow members that may be going through the same situation that you are and they have information that is very useful to you. You know that you have uh, a complete college, not only of men from the United States, but from around the world, who you can pick up the phone and call uh, to get answers for uh, some problem you may be working on. You can also participate as a speaker, as an active uh, participant in many of the symposia that we offer nationally and internationally. Also, we have advocacy groups that work with the government and other policymakers. Internationally, we have placed uh, 51 workshops throughout the world, and you can be part of that. I have participated in workshops that have been put on by the American College of Clinical Engineering in I think something like 20 different foreign countries over the years. Spending a year in a country like that with the local people and, and living in the local community was, was just a wonderful experience and we, 
We made many good friends that uh, I've maintained ever since. I always found that very exciting. Not only did you feel like you were accomplishing something from the standpoint of advancing uh, other countries, uh, but it was very satisfying to, to, uh, uh, to see what those countries were doing at that time and then watch as they made changes to make improvements. The mission of the American College of Clinical Engineering is as follows. First, to establish a standard of competence and to promote excellence in clinical engineering practice. Secondly, to promote safe and effective applications of science and technology in healthcare. Third, to define the body of knowledge on which the profession is based. And lastly, to represent the professional interest of clinical engineers. Technology in healthcare is going through a very interesting phase. Many new technologies are coming into the field. Many other professions are coming to practice in the, in the, same, in the same area. As an organized, as an integrated technology, we need to do things different. So moving forward, uh, we need to be working with other organizations and ourselves are going to be changing in a way that we're going to require, um, you know, first, you know, larger infrastructure. We need to move to the next level. We need to be ready for our future.